guys welcome back to my channel and if you're new here karibu sana i make bullet journal videos and other random stuff like i mentioned in my july setup i got a new journal and it's dotted from a lady called doris i'll link her page in the description box below so you can check her front cover designs out i started off by setting up a journal and keeping it pretty much the same as my previous one and pretty basic for the bullet journal the only thing i migrated to this journal is my fitness tracker and that's it so okay now let's set up august i got to mention though i was so excited about using a dotted journal i felt like i was learning again i was so used to using my boxes and this felt so intimidating and i was awkward starting out but i gained a little bit of confidence as i kept setting it up all right um the theme this month is constellations i've always loved constellations from the day i learned about them in primary school just know everything you're going to see here will have a leo sign on it then I started off my monthly page with a title and for the lettering I just uh, used the dots to write in uh, the letters and it worked perfectly for me at this point and I found it easy. Uh, once I got a handle on that I was able to relax and be able to write better. And then I set up the grid boxes again it was really tough to count all the dots and all that but eventually ended up with boxes that were seven by seven dot spaces and I was pretty happy with how it turned out. Then I added a few stars at the top of my monthly because I thought it added a little bit of color and it just added a little bit of aesthetic. Then I went ahead and put in my Leo sign. It was really hard to get a handle on the alignment of the stars but eventually I did. And then of course I have a quote there because I roll like that or at least for now. And then my trackers for YouTube and Instagram because I do that too. And finally, I filled the monthly with the days and the dates and my monthly was done. Starting off my habit track, of course, I have my title at the top and adding a little bit of aesthetic again. Uh, going with my theme, I added in a few stars at the top just to give it a pop of color. And then I changed up the habit tracker from all the writing that I've been doing uh, the past few months to one singular rectangle thing that is happening there. And then I split it into two where I have my dates and days and the habits that I want to track. And it was really simple and I was happy about this. I'm just using my uh, big biro pen to do that over there because I found that it was easier for me to write in in the in between the dots and then I added in my habits and the things that are not such as habits on the other side at the bottom so that I can track them too. Then of course a little sign to keep up with them and that was done. Of course, I love the mood tracking thing and it is a starry mood tracker and a legend at the bottom. I really loved how this one turned out. next two pages hold the gratitude and brain dump pages just with minimal detail to allow writing a lot of stuff in and of course at the bottom I'll have my Leo signs uh, just to keep up with the theme but that is all that I do with these pages. I always have a collection for meal planning so that is just what I'll do here a title a little bit of stars a very little detail and then split the weeks into four to allow a lot of writing in and that's just it now 
Now this page is the one that has changed much from all of them and this is my function page and all I have here uh, is my daily and my weekly tasks. I decided to have them on the same page. Uh, this was a real brain workout, but uh, I'll see how this one works. But it, it took a lot of thinking to uh, create uh, this particular one. But again, I hope it really works. If it doesn't, I might change it next month. But for now, this is how it will look. My daily tasks have uh, one calendar going across and the tasks that I want to track. And for my weekly, as you will see, are going to be a lot different. And I really liked how it turned out, but it was really a big uh, change. I'm setting up my weekly log and this is what I usually uh, share mostly on my IG page so if you'd like to see how uh, the rest of the month will look like you can head over there and follow me and you'll see what I'll be up to it was just simple and spacious my title and my Leo sign and then the dates and the days uh, highlights and notes and then split it all into very big spacious spaces I finished my weekly I remembered to number all my pages and then finally here's my August flip through I also remembered to join up the dots to give it a better look and so I did for every Leo sign as you can see I hope you enjoyed the video and drew some inspiration from it if you did I remember to give me a like you can also comment down below and if you want to really make my day you can subscribe to my channel and I'll see you in other videos ahead. Have a great month and I'll see you next time. Bye.